Good morning, Cardinals, and happy Friday, happy spring break eve. Hope you guys are having a glorious morning so far. We have several birthdays uh, this weekend, but also over spring break. First, Max Russell, third grade today. Uh, tomorrow, we have Madeline Seibert, fourth grade. Milana Spears, kinder cardinal. Nico Stenuff, kinder, our second grader. On Sunday, we have Sophie Fournier, fifth grader. Nora Harsh, second grader. Carter Schwartz, first grade. Mrs. Lampley, opposite aid. On Tuesday, we have Tegan Cafferty, kinder cardinal. On Wednesday of spring break, we have Kendall Babluski, fourth grader. And on Thursday, we have Mason McDonald, second grader. On Friday, Parker Krause, kinder cardinal. Kate Finn, fourth grader. Bobby Lehman, fourth grader. On Saturday, April 1st, we have Mrs. Sachs, fifth grade teacher. And then on Sunday, April 2nd, we have Declan Mitchell, second grader. Hope you all have wonderful birthdays over spring break. Oh, we'll save we'll save the Monday ones for when we come back. Okay, weather report today, cloudy high of 41 degrees. Hopefully you have a sunshiny uh, spring break where you can get out and play a ton. Lunch today, soft pretzels or mini beef calzonets. Uh, and then Monday, I don't know what you're going to have for lunch on Monday. You'll probably be at home. So whatever's in your fridge. Let's get a quick update on Mr. Miser's Cardinal Concert Challenge. We have a couple months left in the school year. I guess, yeah, about a couple months left in the school year. And in order to have the concert that Mr. Miser is planning put on for you guys, we have two goals that we have to meet. The first of which is we have to finish filling this marble jar. And it looks like we are not quite two thirds of the way full, about four sevenths of the way full. So almost 60% of the way full. So continue to be kind, be safe, be focused, be high on heroes. Let's fill up your classroom marble jars and our big marble jar. The other goal that we have to meet in order to get the concert is we have to read 50,000 books. As of today, we have read 33,454. So we have 16,500 and 46 books left to read between now and the end of the school year. So if you're not reading, we need you to start reading. And if you're reading, but you're not filling out the ticket, we need you to fill out the tickets to make sure we reach our goal before the end of the year so we can have an amazing concert to end our school year. Speaking of people helping us reach our goal, congratulations to Mrs. Crandall's class. Um, each and every one of the students in Mrs. Crandall's class has now turned in a ticket. Uh, they've all read at least uh, 10 books and mark those down. So the belt went to them. All right. It is funny joke Friday. And here to help me with funny joke Friday this week, we have some friends from Mrs. Briggs's class. So they've got some really good ones and they're going to step up here and they are going to share their jokes with you guys. So Miss PJ, you are first. Come on over. Why did the cow cross the road to go to the movies? That was a good one. What animal can jump higher than a house? All of them, a house can't jump. Nice job, Mr. Rossino. Why did the students eat their homework? Because the teacher said it's going to be a piece of cake. Nice job, you guys. How do you stop a bull from charging? You unplug it. I like it. I like it. Why did the egg stay home from school? He was expelled. <laughs> Last and certainly not least. What happened when the strawberry got sad? He turned into a blueberry. Nice. Nice job. Friends from Mrs. Briggs's class. Well done. All right, boys and girls. Today is Friday, March 24th, 2023. I hope each and every one of you has a restful, um, fun, and rejuvenating spring break. Be safe. We look forward to seeing all of you guys back here right after spring break. Today, let's be kind. Let's be safe. Let's be focused. And let's make today count, Cardinals.